Be careful in the kitchen. See you later then. Bye bye. Have bye. a great time, honey. Bye. You seem too happy I'm leaving. You better remember everything you promised me. Get all of our homework done. Don't leave messes anywhere. And I will not let the children starve. Please don't give them only junk food, all right? Not gonna happen. I'm making something from the book. I'll make you whatever you want as long as it's in wow. here. Dad, hmm? that, that sounds, sounds awesome. awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Yahoo! I'm finally done! Jin! Jin huh? What's that, Jin? This is called the three-step alarm. Three-step three step alarm? I've never heard of that. That might be, because I just invented it. It rings when children cross into what should be a child-free area. Child-free area? Yeah. A child-free area is a one-meter zone around things that can cause an accident, like a stove or a heater. Children should be kept from entering that zone. Very smart! Huh? Why is it ringing, Jin? Well, a child walked into the area, didn't he? I am not a child. Just because you're big doesn't mean that you're an adult yet. Go <laughs> 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 oh, away, <wait>, monster! <laughs> 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 That's amazing, Dad! It's done! Not a chance! Not a chance! And he shoots! Oh. 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 Tweet, huh? you're out, Dad! Dad's out! <laughs> huh? huh? It's Mom. Shh! Hmm? Shh! <clears throat> Hello? Everybody's fine. Peter? Uh, of course he's doing his homework. Lucy? Oh, yeah, she's picking up her toys. Dinner? Yep, almost done. It already smells great. Guess I'll move along now. Please don't forget to install your new three-step alarm. We'll install it. Thanks again. Bye-bye, Roy. Next stop is Little Peter's house. Hmm. Right. First, we chop all the onions up. This is how you do it. Like this. Come on, Dad. Let me slice a few. No, no. Knives are dangerous. Uh -huh. oh. My oh, eyes. Oh. Oh. Now, who wants to sprinkle huh? the salt? I do. Take that. Now the pepper. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Adieu. Adieu. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, smells great! It's almost done. Huh? Bet that's Mom. Hang tight for a second, kids. Mm-hmm. Hello? Hey, I'm honey, what's going star. on? Me too. <laughs> what is it, buddy? <gasps> oh, no, the meat's burning! Peter, what are you doing? The meat's going to burn. It needs to be turned. Ow! Hot. Uh, oh, I just turn? Other side, and done! Peter! Huh? Peter! <laughs> Peter! Lucy, why do you keep screaming? Just look! Just look! Huh? Ah! We'll have dinner any minute now. Hurry home. Ah! Huh? <laughs> Children! <laughs> huh? Smoke's coming out of Peter's house! <laughs> Peter, grab onto my hand! Okay! Children! Robert! You all need to get out of the house! Right, sure. <laughs> Just thank goodness that nobody got hurt. Thank uh -huh. you, Roy. You saved all our lives, I'm sure. To make sure that this doesn't happen anymore, I've got some safety tips for you. When you're cooking, never leave the kitchen while the stove is on. A fire can break out at any time. Also, put nothing flammable, such as towels or paper, near the stove's flame, because these can easily spread fire. And don't let pets or children get near the flames or the hot food. They might have an accident, and since they won't know how best to deal with it, they can be seriously injured. Yes! yes. All, right. All right. What's going on here? Huh? It's, it's mom. mom! I'm home because you said dinner would be ready now. Why are you all outside? Uh, well... 
<clears throat> well, honey, you know, about the dinner. The thing is, uh, we're eating out instead. What are you talking about? I just thought we'd go out to eat. Yay! We're eating out! How to cross the street safely. Kevin, Kevin, we're late. Hurry up. <laughs> hey, Doug. I made Jenny this dinosaur myself. Huh. Well, she's not gonna like it. Oh, yeah? Well, let's see what you got her. Sure. I got her a present that any girl would love to have. Show me. Whoa! I want it! <laughs> Can you? Oh, no. This is a birthday gift for Jenny. But, Dougie, Jenny won't appreciate a beetle as much as me. I bet she likes it more than she likes your dinosaur. Are you serious? I am. Uh, why don't we go ask Jenny which present she likes better? Okay. Uh, I'll show her mine first. Hey, wait for me. Wait up, dog. Coming through, boys. Move aside, please. Whoopers on the road. <laughs> uh. What a busy day. So many deliveries. Let's go. Guy, I don't have all day. That's your problem. What? <laughs> Can you speed up? Oh, sure thing. Huh? Learn how to drive. <laughs> that sure was a close one. <laughs> Cooper, you've gone past the stop line. Oh, holy. What if someone had run into the crosswalk? Sorry, my bad. Mm. Whenever you come to a crosswalk, slow down, okay, Wooper? I will, Polly. Uh, uh, green light. I'll see you later, Polly. Wooper. <coughs> I'm not sure he's learned his lesson. To wait for the light. Uh. You stop, because I was running faster. Excuse me, I was way ahead of you. Yeah, well, I was just going to pass you. Uh. Oh, yeah? Uh. Fine, let's see who's the fastest uh. one. Great, but it's not going to be you. Uh. Yeah, that posty, he's always putting me behind schedule. Uh, there he is. He won't block me this time. This could get really dangerous. Green light! Go! Wooper, you should have slowed down. No. You boys okay? Us. Uh, Kevin, Doug, you should never run across the street like that, even when the light is green. But, Polly, I thought it was okay to cross when it's green. Yeah, me too. Green means go, but just because the light's green doesn't mean it's safe to run across. Some cars might miss the light change and not be able to stop in time. Then what are we supposed to do when we have to cross the street, Polly? We'd fly if we could, but we can't. <laughs> I know. Just remember three steps and you can cross the street safely and easily. Three, three steps? Step one, always stop at the curb before you enter into a crosswalk and wait for the green light. And even if the light is green, stop and look in all directions first. Step two, make sure all cars are stopped before you cross. Make eye contact with the drivers and check that all cars are stopped as you cross. Step three, don't take your eyes off the cars while you're crossing. Always keep watching to make sure that you see the cars and the drivers see you. Okay. Pretty simple, right guys? Yeah. Just remember, 
It's not about how fast you cross, it's about how safely you cross. Got it? Got it, Polly! <laughs> 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 Happy birthday, Jenny! Thanks, guys! Jenny, Jenny I, I got, got a birthday present for you! Which, Which one, one is better? better? Oh, my dinosaur's better, right? A beetle that's alive is way better! Ah, it's a tie! What do you mean, Jenny? I hate them both! Ah. Be careful when the wind is strong. <sighs> wow. <laughs> this hill is the best for kite flying. Wow, Johnny. How do you get your kite so high? <laughs> My secret. <laughs> Are you flying your little kites? Well, take a look. No kite can outfly my eagle. Yeah, yeah! Huh? <laughs> the eagle's the king. Uh, Peter, your kite looks a little strange. <gasps> no! The eagle has fallen. Peter, <laughs> kites can't be just any cool shape. Yeah, Peter. If a kite isn't balanced, it's hard to fly. Peter, do you need my help to make a kite that flies? <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing! You'll see. This one is wrong. What's as strong as rock, but as flexible as a bow? Aha! Hmm. Uh -huh. I've got it! Huh, where could it be? Honey, you see my fishing rod? <laughs> That's right! The fishing rod works great! <laughs> um... <laughs> My masterpiece is done! Superstorm! <laughs> Guys, we have a problem. A big typhoon from the southeast is headed for Broomstown. We need to make extra sure the town's prepared. All, All right, right, Jin! Jin. <laughs> <laughs> the weather's absolutely perfect! Best ever first flight! Fly, Superstorm! fall down, and you can get hurt by all kinds of flying stuff. So on a day with a strong wind warning, please don't go outside. If you are outside and a strong wind starts, you should take shelter in a safe building. Also, there's a danger of electric shocks from electric poles, street lights, or traffic lights. Avoid touching them! All right, Peter? Yeah, 
I promise not to go outside whenever there's a strong wind. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> Looks like Johnny's got the highest kite again. Johnny, what's your big secret? <laughs> well, the secret is... Go Superstar! <laughs> yeah! Wow, Peter! Your kite flies crazy high! Looks like it's perfectly <laughs> balanced. <laughs> Superstorm has no rival. It survived in the strongest winds. Um, yeah, it's all right. <gasps> oh, no! My Superstorm! <laughs> Never forget to turn off the gas. Mom? What are you doing? <gasps> Strawberries? <laughs> We're making strawberry jam today. It's so good on bread. Yay, awesome! Ooh, strawberries, yeah! Stop that! These are for strawberry jam. Come on, you've got plenty of them there. Children, stop fighting and be good until the jam's ready, all right? Yes. yes. <laughs> Yummy jam, jam, jam! Mom, I'm about to <laughs> die of hunger. It's almost done. <sighs> Just have to let it simmer down. So, can I have a little taste? Back up! Hey, what's your problem? Jam is for eating on bread. Huh? It's traditional. Uh -huh. Lucy, fetch some bread from the living room. Yes, Mom. <laughs> hey. huh? oh. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Mommy, look. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> My Bad dog! Lucy, we'll get more bread. Don't cry. <laughs> Lucy, want me to carry the bread? No. I have to protect it from the bad, naughty dog. Huh. He probably ate the jam while we were gone. <gasps> oh, no! <gasps> Mom, hurry, buddy's eating all the jam! <laughs> Relax, Lucy. The jam is still up on the stove, so Buddy can't get it. <gasps> Children, I think I forgot to turn the stove off. What happens when you don't turn it off? The jam might start to burn, and there could be a fire. <laughs> oh, the jam will burn up? The jam isn't the problem. The whole house could burn down. <laughs> no! no! Look out! Huh? <laughs> 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 oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> So you're all right uh, down there. I'm just fine, thanks. <laughs> We're almost home. <gasps> Come on. Hurry up, Mom. <gasps> Kids, just follow your mom. <laughs> <gasps> this way's blocked, too. Come on. Oh, Mom, what'll happen if Buddy of our house uh, burns down? Uh, <laughs> buddy, I'm sorry I called you bad name. <laughs> No, that must not happen! Go, oh, Mom. Mom. <laughs> Here, this should work. <laughs> Come on, we're going home! You You're are really awesome, awesome Mom! Mom. Just a little bit further now. Peter! Huh? Peter, Why? is something wrong? But he's all by himself at home. And I didn't remember to turn off the stove. Let's get there. Buddy! 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 Huh? <gasps> huh? Uh, hi. What's going on? Buddy! <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing Robert turned off the stove, or it could have been a real disaster. Sorry, Roy. I should have been more careful. 
I'll give you a couple of safety tips for using the stove. When the stove is in use, never leave it unattended. The pot might overheat and start a fire, or the ingredients may overflow and cause a gas leak. Also, before using the stove, make sure that there's no smell of gas in the air. If you start the stove when there is a gas leak, it could explode, so please always check. Also, make sure that the fire is fully lit. If the knob is turned while the fire is off, the gas could leak. Lastly, always remember to turn off the gas valve after using the stove. If you're worried you might forget, installing a gas timer might be a helpful precaution. We will. Thank you, Roy. Hey, Mom, can we please have some jam? Yes. <laughs> yeah. But where is the jam? <laughs> I left it on the table. Uh, oh, 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 buddy! <laughs> <laughs> Streetwise. Wow! That looks good! Thanks, but this one isn't for you. It's a surprise present for Mrs. Rora. It's her birthday today. May I have pink teensy slice? If she gets one, so should I. Don't worry, huh? I'll bake for you too. Yahoo! <laughs> I really want a pie! Yeah? Well, I'd like to trade Mom's pie for some of Mrs. Rora's chocolate chip cookies. Ah, me too, me too. <laughs> Cab's supposed to deliver the pie, but he's running a little late. It's going to get cold. I can take it to her. Huh? Really? <laughs> it's not too far. Please, let me go. All right. And while you're gone, I'll bake a pie for you, okay? Yeah! And I'm going to come too. What do you mean? It's too far, Susie. You just said it isn't far. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, kids. Uh, Wish Mrs. Rora a happy birthday uh, for me. Mom, I don't want to take her. If Susie listens to you, there won't be any problems. Right, Kevin? Uh, no. Will you listen to Kevin? Yes! <laughs> Go straight to the main road, Kevin. Yeah. Susie, hurry up, will ya? The pie's gonna get cold. I'm trying. Huh? Kevin, where are you going? This is the shortcut to Mrs. Rora's. But Mom told us to go straight to the main road. It's okay. I know the way better than Mom. Are you sure? Sure, I'm sure. Okay, Cab, you're all set. I feel like new, Amber. Oh, oh boy. Gotta run an errand for Kevin's mom. Bye, Cab. We'll see you again soon. Whoa! Oh. The street is weird. Why do the cars come so close? Well, see, this is kind of a road, okay? Oh. Oh. Okay, pal, back up. I came in first. What are you talking about? I was here first. You uh, back up. This is you scary. Uh, don't worry about them, Susie. We're almost there. I think this way might be faster. Kevin, I'll take it for a while. Oh, thanks, Susie. <laughs> What happened, Cab? Holy! <laughs> you okay, Susie? That pie was for Mrs. Rora! Oh, it's okay. <laughs> I'm sure that Mrs. Rora will be very happy that both of you are safe. Cab, I'm surprised. You know you need to be extra careful and watch for pedestrians in alleys like this. I'm sorry. It's huh? all my fault, Polly. Kevin, Susie, there are some simple rules you should always follow when you walk in places where there's no sidewalk, and I'd like to teach them to you. Okay. First, always walk along the side of the road, not in the middle. If you walk in the middle, you can't see cars coming behind you, and that's dangerous. Second, always stop and move to the side when cars want to get by. Walk after they pass. Drivers can't always see you. 
always stop and look carefully before crossing. <gasps> Never run out. Third, when you walk on a narrow road, don't walk side by side. Always walk in a line. And it's not a good idea to carry anything on the side the cars are on. If one gets too close, a little bump can cause a big accident. So follow the rules, and even a walk down a narrow road can be a lot safer for everybody. Okay, Polly. That's great, but the pie's ruined. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. Mom's baking another one. That's right. <laughs> Mrs. Rora, we're here. Oh, what a surprise. Happy birthday, Mrs. Mrs. Rora. How sweet. This is a pie for you from my mom. Oh, well, isn't that thoughtful? Come on in. I think I have something for you, too. <laughs> Wow! Chocolate chip cookies! These are my favorite cookies in the whole world! They're my favorite cookies in the whole entire universe! Well, I must admit, <laughs> I like them too. Bees show up. Heave ho! Careful! All done. Now it's safe, Cleany. Thank you so much. <laughs> huh? Jin, something wrong? Looks like there's another beehive that needs to be moved. This one's at Cindy's house. All right. We'll go right away. Helly, mm -hmm. let's get to Cindy's house. You bet. <laughs> Goodbye, you guys. Ta-da! Whoa, super yum! It's the new double chocolate dream donut. I had to line up so early in the morning to get them. Ah, oh, 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 ah it's a bee! Just a tiny bee. Nothing to be scared of. <laughs> Peter, look there. Look where? That big beehive get there. My donut. They're only selling that kind for one day. <sighs> Fine. Bees or not, that's my donut. Johnny. Johnny. Double chocolate dream! Johnny, you all right? Well, at least I managed to rescue one. <laughs> no! Oh. Ah, I have an idea that might work. Easy does it. Little bit more. Just uh, hurry up. Back uh, off. Uh, Let me do it. Uh, <laughs> you got it. Awesome! Uh, 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 close the door. Uh, hurry! Uh, oh, my donut. It's gone forever. Oh. <gasps> uh, Aha! Mm -hmm. Guys, I need your help. Huh. Mm -hmm. huh. Uh. Man, ready to go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Operation Rescue Donuts. Peter's the man. I have eyes on the donuts, moving deep into enemy territory. Three seconds until donut rescue. Two seconds. One second. Mission success! Yahoo! He did it! <laughs> now I walk out. Huh? Ah! Ah! Go! Go away! Ah! Ah! Kids! Uh, 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 Johnny! Hey, kids! 
kids! I'm coming! Are you all right? Nobody got stung? Yeah, we're okay. <laughs> we'll be happy to take the beehive. <sighs> Thanks, Thanks a lot. lot, children. Let me tell you what to do if you ever run into bees. Listen up. When you find bees, don't try to get rid of them yourselves. Just quietly move away. If you find a beehive, do not touch it. Just call the authorities and it will be removed safely. If bees chase you, cover your head and lie down. Protect your body. If a bee stings you, don't touch it and go to the nearest hospital for treatment. You can remember that, right? Sure, sure Amber, Amber, of, of course. course. I think it's time to eat some donuts, you guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm starving. <gasps> There's another bee! <gasps> no, my double chocolate dream! <laughs> Our family fire drill. Have a nice day. Oh, hi, Roy. <laughs> Afternoon. What's that? Fire evacuation drill? Yep. Families can all do this program, practice fire drills, and make a plan so they know just what to do. If they pass, they get a safety badge, too. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Would you like one? Huh? Hmm. <laughs> Goodness, what's going on? Oh, oh no! <sighs> what a mess. What would they do if a real fire broke out? <laughs> Straighten this mess out. Honey, you came home. Here, look at this. Huh? Family fire evacuation? Wow, what's that? <sighs> Seems like a lot of fun. Shall we do it? Yeah, yeah! I want to go too! Oh? So everyone agrees? How great! Drill start now. Huh? huh? In one week, we'll be participating in this drill program. Let's do our best to try and stay safe in the event of a fire. Got it? Yes. So, everyone look at this map here. Who can tell me how many exits our house has? I, I can, can, I, I can. can! Okay, what's next? Don't know. I think... Ah! Back door, Lucy! Okay. <laughs> Daddy! Don't worry. Dad will always be there to save you. <laughs> oh. Okay, everyone. The test will begin shortly. When the fire alarm starts, you have three minutes to get out of the house. Ready, set... There's smoke! Get down! Don't be nervous, you two. Just do what we practiced. Got it? Yeah! Leave it to me! Go to the first exit. Front door's on fire. No good. Uh, Option two, the window. The window. Uh, honey, the window's blocked too. It's all going to be fine. We'll find a way out. 30 seconds remaining. No! Uh, 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 Mom, uh, the back door, the uh, third exit. Uh, That's right, the back door. Uh, okay, come, hurry. Okay. Uh, 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 
Ridiculous. I'll never leave you behind. Three, two, one! Congratulations! You all made it! Wow! Awesome job, Dad! Yeah! Phew! There you go! Wow! <laughs> you were able to react quickly with every situation that arose. Often, when there's a real fire, people will panic and forget their safety rules. It only takes five minutes for a fire to spread to dangerous levels, so always remember your evacuation plan. Make a map for your family that clearly marks all emergency exits. Everyone should pick a safe place to meet after evacuating. Twice a year, you should have an actual fire drill with your family. It's good to try it both during the daytime and at night. That way, if a real fire broke out, you know you'd be able to get everyone out of the house safely. Got it, Roy. We, we sure, sure will. will. <laughs> <laughs> Fire? Where? Where? Fire drill time again! Why so we need to do a drill at night, too? Let's go! No, you didn't mean right away! <laughs> Rainy Day Dangers Jenny, I'll share mine with you. Huh? Ah! Oh, no. <laughs> nice try. And even though I don't really want to, I guess I can share my umbrella with a classmate. Jenny! Oh. Hi, Mom. Thanks, guys. See you tomorrow. Oh. See you, Jenny. I hate it when I act polite for no yeah. reason. Ah. But now you can give your umbrella to me. <laughs> what? Why should I? You broke mine. Did not. Did too. Uh, you okay, Posty? Sure. Thanks, Polly. Hey, Polly. Roy. Hello, Spooky. Posty, you all right? Heard your day's not going too well. Yeah, I had a slip. Roads can get slippery especially on rainy days like this one. So, drive carefully. Don't worry. I'll take good care of our friend Posty. Thanks. Bye, guys. Be safe, Spooky. Well, Roy, I'm heading over to the school. Yeah, I guess classes are over by now. Right. And I want to make sure the students all get home safely. You be careful, too, Polly. Will do. Quit hugging it. I'm all wet. I'm getting wetter than you, Kevin. Wrong. Ah! Kevin, what do we do now? I don't know! Ah! 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 This rain just won't go away! I'm so, so am I. Ah! Let's cross! Okay. Gotta hurry! Oh, oh no! I can't see! Hey, look out! Oh, oh, I'm rolling too fast! Oh, this won't be pretty! I'm sorry, Polly. I warned you about driving on wet roads. It's dangerous. You were right. I'll keep that in mind. Kevin and Doug, you should have been more careful too, especially since it was raining. Us too? 
When it rains, it takes more time and distance for a car to stop because the roads are more slippery than usual. Don't walk too close to the curb. It's safer to keep your distance from cars when it rains. It's also a good idea to stay back a few steps from crosswalks. If you get too close, a car could hit your umbrella. Always hold an umbrella higher than your eye level so you don't block your view. An umbrella you can see through is even better. Use a shoulder bag when it's raining to carry papers, books and other things so they don't get wet. When it's dark and rainy, it's safer to wear brightly colored clothes and use a bright umbrella. Dark clothes and dark umbrellas make you hard to see and make accidents easy to happen. It's the same on snowy days, but don't wear white clothes when it snows. They make you blend in too much. Wow! We, we blocked, blocked our view with the umbrella and, and walked, walked right, right into, into the crosswalk without looking. We, we even had, had a dark, dark umbrella. umbrella. Uh, we, we got, got it, it all wrong. wrong! That's true, but now you know how to get things right as rain. Yeah! <sighs> Jenny! You've got nothing to worry about today. You can't share that tiny umbrella with him. Here, I'll share mine. Thanks, guys. But I'm covered. <laughs> OK. Well, see you tomorrow. <sighs> Jenny, wait, wait for, for me. me. Try to keep up. <laughs> 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 Spooky, great job! <laughs> Thanks, it means a lot, Stacy. Oh, wait, one more thing. Hang on. I have a little surprise for you. What's the surprise? Every time you help one of your friends in need, I'll give you a sticker. After five, I'll get you those rainbow tires you really want. Whoa, rainbow tires? Woohoo! That's awesome! <laughs> well, I guess there's no time to waste. See you later! See you around! Good morning, Broomstown. Today's gonna be another hot, scorching day. So make sure to limit your time outside and stay safe and healthy. <laughs> I'll get all the stickers real soon. Then new tires for me. Somebody help! I'm stuck! Whoa, it's Benny. Hang on, buddy, I got this. All better. <laughs> Thanks a bunch, Spooky. Don't worry about it. Just try to be more careful. <laughs> Spooky seems like he's in a really good mood today. Mm. Oh. Uh. Oh. oh, Peter, why didn't you kick it to me? It's too hot to aim right. Johnny, go bring back the ball. No, it's your fault it's so far. You get it. Uh, I don't wanna. Hiya, Posty. Sorry I'm a bit late. What took you so long? You have no idea how busy I am today. <laughs> we'll make up for lost time. Uh, ah, spooky! You're going too fast! Faster? I can go faster. You got it. <laughs> Hi, Musty. Hope you weren't here long. <sighs> but I'm ready to tow you back now. Ooh, you certainly work hard, even in this weather. <laughs> Yep, no time like the present. Uh, you got the wrong place! That's my nose! Spooky, wait! Are you sure you'll be all right? Yep, I'm great. Don't push yourself, Spooky. Maybe we should call Roy to help us out. No way. Mm. I can do it myself. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, you really got this. I'm impressed, Spooky. Hey, thanks. I do what I can. <laughs> and done. Wow, there's only one sticker left. Uh, Spooky, uh, are you sure you're okay? I think you should take a break. No, no, I feel great. Yep, time to go. Wait! Uh, he's working too hard. Uh, one more to go. Just one more sticker till I get those tires. Well, I don't feel so good. Today, uh. everything feels so heavy. I just want to go home and relax. Uh, this is not good. Ah! Kids in the room! Spooky! This is bad! Emergency!
Emergency! Emergency! Spooky's on the coast road oh. hanging off the cliff! Rescue team, you know what to do! Okay! okay. <laughs> Spooky! Help me! I don't want to fall! No need to worry, we're here to help. Helly, hold Spooky mm. up from below. Roy and I will stay up here and pull him back up. Sounds, Sounds good! good. Uh, got you! We're on! Ready to pull! Okay, let's bring him in! Spooky! And there you go! Thanks a lot, Amber. Mm. Spooky, that could have been really bad. You should have given yourself a day of rest. Whenever there's a heat advisory, it's best to follow warnings and not play outside. When it's hot, we sweat and lose water. So we need to drink more water and avoid dehydration. If you have a headache, dizziness, or feel sick to your stomach, get to a cool place as soon as possible to lower your body temperature. And if you still don't feel better after a while, call an ambulance. You might have heat stroke, which could be very dangerous. I see. I won't work too hard in hot weather anymore. <laughs> And, and we'll, we'll be, be careful, careful too. too. Your health is the most important thing. I know, but I just really wanted to collect that last sticker. <laughs> you already did. Here you go, rainbow tires. Oh, did I really do enough for them? Benny called me and said you helped him oh. out as well. That's right, I did. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> rainbow tires. <laughs> 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 Can I get three more? 